That you are going to bear with your precious life for sitting, <laughs> discussing this respectfully about me. <laughs> I am the most powerful man in this comet. Whatever I want, I get. Azure no ribiare, no ye. Nico, please forgive and offer. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, oh. Don't listen to what I'm telling you. Oh, you don't want to know how I will be enjoying your wife when I must have sent you to grab you. Huh? Your wife. Don't touch my wife. If you ever touch my wife, I'll kill you. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. I'll kill you. I have never seen such foolishness in my life. So you are not worried about where you are going. I'm sending you to another world. You are going to another planet. You are not worried about that. You are worried about what will happen between me and <laughs> Did you buy your coffin, your size, before coming here? Two. Did you prepare a grave where that coffin will be put with you inside the coffin before coming here? 
My darling, eh? Why would I want to buy a coffin or dig a grave before coming to see the man of my dreams? You know why? Because if I, I will just kill you, eh? Kill you and bury you somewhere that in the next 50 years nobody will see your corpse. Olukube, kill me. Bury me. Do whatever you want to do to me. As long as your hands and body touches mine. At least let me show you how much I love you and how much I want you to be my man. Hey! Ipugwalarao! This is madness. You are insane. I have told you, Kelechi, I don't want to have anything to do with you. Leave me alone, Hapumaka. Is it by force? Is it by force? And how many times have I told you that I will never leave you alone? Eh? I love you, Onukube, and that is what matters to me. Eh. Yes. Yeah. Get out of this place. Shame up before I commit more than I idiot. Okay. Get out! Is it by force? Thank you. I will go. Ah. I only came here to give you a good meal. I don't know why you just prefer to be lonely. Eh? When you know I can always give you a, a, a good company and make you happy. Come on, carry it home. I'm going to get you, no matter what you say or do. Or no matter what that your stupid girlfriend says or do. Mark my word. Come on, get out. Before I, I, I send you to you won't see people, you know. Even, even if you're, you're coming to see a man this, this hot afternoon. Nonsense. Please, please, please leave me alone. Leave me alone before I place a curse on you. <laughs> hey. 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 You will place a curse on me. Oh, yes. Oh, because I'm asking you as your wife, as your woman, as the woman you claim to love to buy things for me. You said you will place a curse on me. In my family, I will go and tell the villagers all you've said. My husband wants to place a curse on me because I asked him to buy clothes for me. Come on. I never said I will not give you money to buy clothes. No, okay, Nemma, and you know that. Eh? What I said is that that amount you are asking for me, I don't have it. Eh. And I cannot steal just to make my wife happy. It's your Yes. You put your phone man. Well spoken. Let me tell you something. Eh? Let me just tell you something. Okay. I will tell you something that men now do. Fellow men like you, they take care of their wives. If their wives need anything, clothes in particular, so their wives will work out and look good, they go out and buy it, no matter what it costs. <laughs> you see, all those men are, are not like them. Men that will go out of their abilities just to make their wife happy. What kind of man are you? I cannot steal just to make you happy. Eh. I have to live within my own income. G which income? Eh? Can't income I or? live within my which income. Which income? And, uh, listen, listen. I know where you are leading this quarrel to, right. but I, I, I promise you, where? <laughs> you cannot have your wish granted. Hey, yes. I have to say that Ah, ah, Mama, what is it? What is it? Papa, uh -huh. what is it again? Every time quarrel, quarrel, what is it? Uh -huh. Hey, Mom, I'm glad you're asking that question. You see, this is your father. What can I do in a one night? This is your father. He's useless. Mm. Yeah, he has poverty running Madame in his, in his uh, 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 bloodline. Yes, he's dying in the state of poverty. He cannot even buy me what I want. This man, he cannot look after me as a woman. On a matter of money, on a matter of money, no man, you know, nonsense now. Quietly buy me something and make me look good. Mama, what are you talking about? Hmm. Thank you, my daughter. Let me tell you what this year, Mama, is talking about. Do you know what? She want me to go and sell that piece of land. That only piece of land we have. Our only piece of land. Eh? 
not only selling it to. But do you know who, who she's asking me to sell it to? This wicked man, Chief Oliver. Okay. Chief Oliver. I will go and sell the land to him just to have enough money to give her. Buy lots of clothes <laughs> and whatever she wants. I will not sell it. Uh, uh, Mama. Yes. How can you say such a thing now, eh? Everyone in this village and beyond knows who Chief Oliver is and what he's capable of doing. The whole know he snatches people's property and take what does not belong to him. It's your problem. Mama, that land is the only land we have in this family and oh. it's going nowhere. Thank you very much, yes. my daughter. Yes, twins, slim twin, fat twin. Ha! Udu mini na okachi. Ano me kilono. Well done. You are twins in this state of poverty. I will not say anything. Sure. Ah, I will not say anything. Ogaranya. I will stand and be watching you people. But I pray, God, be any when no, Lisa. I pray that you will let these people live to see how we could be to reach, live like a rich man once in your life. Eh? Before they die in this state of poverty, hey. hopeless man. Make one of the snafi. Will you ever find a perfect man in this state? Look at, this. Look at what you are wearing. Hopeless man. You don't look here. You can't do anything. Because I don't have time for you. All I know is that you don't what I need. I don't have fear. I don't want. 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 If I don't give me this this night, honestly, I am going to blow. You are going to blow. You are going to blow seriously. You are going to blow. Let me alone. Do you know what I took before coming here? Eh? I took a camel, quick out, and a bottle of big stuff. Eh. So if you don't give me this thing, there is trouble. This thing. You, this thing. That you come and pour everything inside me. You took everything before coming. See, chief, the only thing that will make me to Jahela for you is when you put that thing in my pounds. Hey. If we gawa, inyo kona ana mia mepezelegi. Give me the money I asked you to give me. Half maka. Ni me go. Ni me go. I'm going now. Honestly speaking, the point is that I didn't come out here with any money. As you can see, there is no pocket. Mm. Yes, but I promise you one thing. First thing tomorrow morning, I am going to give you that money. Sometimes I'm going to give you that credit. It's no cheap. I don't have my credit. Me. I don't have my Osho free. Or you think I, I left, I snaked out from my father's house to this place for me to come and do Osho free. It's not possible. Let me go back to my father's no, house. No, no. You've Trust not me. heard the say that money for hand, back for ground. Yeah, Since yeah. you don't have money, let me go. I'm going to my house. No, don't go now. Do you have to apply that condition on G for one? Yes. Hey, Amaka. You're very wicked. Hey, let me carry my wickedness back to my father's house. Eh? I'm very serious, though. I'm not joking. Yeah, don't worry. Come on. Ah. 
You are very wicked. Eh, hey, I'm very wicked. Let me carry my wickedness to my father's house. You have the money. Go down and let me count it. Since man, since man, you have the money and you held it all this way. Cheleno, Maja, Heregia, to the man come to China. Kudo da, kudo da na. When I told you, I mean, when I saw this your haircut, I just told myself that you pick this hair just for me. Eh? I started asking, what, what style is this? Oh, swag. Swag. Mm. Hey, yeah, swag. I, I, I did it. I'll be swaggering. When you see it, the thing will not be. Uh, 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 yeah, I love it. Uh, 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 kind of question is that? I love you. Whether I love you. When Owanine, the whole world knows full well that my heart beats for no other one than my one and only Ami Love. Ami Veveton, Ami Beken. They know it. Onukube, <laughs> Onukube. Stop patronizing me. All these things you're saying, they will not get to me. Where is this coming from? I don't understand what is it. What kind of a boyfriend are you that you don't take care of your girlfriend? Diego, uh, Diego. I know you are saying all this because of the money I promised you two weeks ago. Is that not it? Yes, Onukube. Is that why you should say, ask me whether I love you? Onukube, see, I asked you to give me money to buy cloth instead of wearing this one uh, every time. Since two weeks ago, you refused. Now it's three weeks, so you've not given me the my money. My love, my love, I will give you the money. I'm here to receive the money and expect it. I will give you. Eh? Is that what you have to say? No, I just said, see, you just have to be very patient with me. I mean, eh? I'm expecting some money. When it comes, I'll give I'll even give you more. Ah, no, 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 please, 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 please. See, let me tell you the, the truth. It's because of my father that I'm still talking to you. My father, that is why I'm still with you. You have succeeded in making everybody to believe you are one good man. When you are not a good man. I won't miss you, you don't take care of me. You, you be pretending, acting like you are a good man. Me, man, I won't miss you. See, if not because of those people and my father, I would have long kicked you out of my way. Mm. You think you are my class? But come, I will be no It's already here. Ruth will be no be. More. You think I have your time? You. Kick out of me. Yeah, they have your time. I will be no be. Everything I say is here. I will be no be. Unless it was Ibu Madu, you want to kill somebody and you will bury me. Eh? And they will say, ah, here lies the body of our dear brother Onukube. He was killed, he died from a heartbreak, from his one and only army love. Onukube, he won't be. Mbe okokode, okay, back ebo. Nebe, kekwa nye. Nye, nye, mo, o, o, ta. Nye, nye, msi, nye, mge, ju. Nye, 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 when I have money. <laughs> My friend Obiora, Chief Obiora, you are welcome. <laughs> I just say I want to see my friend and know how you are doing. That's why I'm here this morning. Oliver, hmm? what do you want from me this morning? Mm -hmm. huh? As you can see, I'm going to the farm with my children. I'm not ready for your usual troubles. Oh, Obiora, why are you saying this? No matter anything, at least you should reply my greetings. Why are you saying these things? And look at the way you are addressing me. 
You are addressing me only by I am a chief. Uh, we are not in secondary school. <laughs> chief, Oliver, where did you get your chief testing title from? Huh? Or do you want me to tell the whole world how you paid for your ch chief testing title and grabbed it from the king by force? Huh? I came here to greet you. I came here to speak with you like a friend and you are just insulting me. Why are you doing that? Oliver, I am not insulting you. I am telling you only who you are. You are wicked and evil. Change your ways, then we can be friends. Ah, so you consider it better for you to be my enemy than my friend in this village. Have you forgotten the kind of man you are dealing with? Have you forgotten? Imagine your name, Who are you? Who are you? Huh? Who do you think you are? You are just a murderer, eh? a land grabber, a thief, to credit all, a woman's snatcher. Or do you want me to mention more? How dare you? Eh? How dare you? How dare you insult me before your children? Me? Oliver, I am not insulting you. I am telling you to change your ways. Change your ways. Or you perish. Listen, anybody that is serving the living God doesn't fear people. I don't fear you. Eh? All I'm advising you is to change your ways or you perish. You will perish if you don't change your ways. Papa, it's okay. You have said enough. Let's go to the farm. We have a lot of My questions. dear, let's go and do what we came here for. Don't mind him. This is unbelievable. Standing before me and all train rubbish. <laughs> but one thing is sure, whatever I want, I get it. Boys, let's go. You did not see me. Idiot. If I ask Thunder to strike now and blind those your two eyes, they will say I'm a bad person. Idiot. Oh, look, wait. Talk to me. Talk to me. Are, are you deaf? Or are you blind? Or, or are you just being stupid? Hmm? No, tell me which of them is your problem so that I, I, I'll start the healing process. Idiot. Touch me again. Touch me just one more time. You will see what I will turn you into. Just touch me one more time. If I touch you, what will you do? What will you do if I touch you? No, tell me, what will you do? Can you, can you fight with me? Can you stand me? Can you fight with me? Oh, look at me, what will you do now? You make mouth too much. Hey, or, or, or will you kill me the way you killed your parents in, in, in the car accident? Or, or did you use charm in, in, in killing them? No, answer me. Or you think the village does not know? It is obvious you were sent to spoil my day. I did not see you. You will not succeed. Just go your way. Just go your way. Omokume, what will you do? Omokume, go to the city. Go to the city and do what your mates do to make money. Look at you. You were born in this village. You were raised in this village. Until you go to Benopos, you are still here. Go to the city. It is because of people like you that youth are like us are not having a headway in this, in, this, in this village. Go to the city. Idiot. Just leave this place now before I commit murder. Did you hear me? I said leave this place now before I commit murder. Please, murder. I go. Murder. I will go. I will go and it's not because I'm scared of you. You are too small for me to handle. Come, come. You are too small for me to handle. Come on, Kube. Let me tell you something. I want you to know that your cup is gradually getting filled in this village. And I'll personally be the one to lead the boys that will come and beat you. Idiot like you. I said leave this place. If I don't go, what will you do? I said no, no, let's go to where we will not separate us. I said let's go to where we will not separate us. Let's go. Let's go to where we will not separate us. Idiot. Why, why, why didn't you leave? 
mistake. I know the Are you okay? What happened? My beloved wife, all is not well. Chief Oliver is on my neck. He is trying to assassinate my character. Come. Which Chief Oliver are you talking about? Manomara Majuro Mandri Aguaro. Chief Oliver, you know. Tell me what happened. Chief Oliver said. I should leave the only piece of land my father left for me. Which is impossible. Mba no no. Uh, but wait though, my husband. You know that man is dangerous. You don't need to fight with him. The way you're going about it, that man will kill you for nothing. My wife, no matter how long it takes Stamara, he will surely call his father's name. I will fight him. I will get back what belongs to me. I am a freedom fighter. The mama, that man is evil. That man is not only evil, he's also wicked. How do you intend to fight him? With a gun? How many bullets will you release? I beg you in the name of God. We have to look for another way. Don't know. You don't have to confront him in any way. Please. My, Please. My beloved wife. I've said it! I'm so sorry, B! I will get back what belongs to me! I am a true fighter! Hey, mama, you can't do this! You can't fight this man with your hands! Come into a way! I want the Aguaro! You want to turn me to a widow, no? Oh, Manti, 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 leave him alone! You cannot do anything! Leave him, let him deal with that man! What about you, Seba? Nonsense! You don't do anything! Come on, you get don't out! Do anything. Get out! You don't feel to run after your ill and tell him to stop your hair, tell him that man cannot do anything. Can you fight him? Oh God in heaven, what will I do? This man wants to turn me to a widow. Hi God. Where is my husband? Where is my husband? I've not seen him now for the past three days. Just calm down. Let's give him a little time. He will come, please. Just calm down. He will come. Let's give him a little time. I don't have all the whole patience. I don't you have calm down. He will come, please. <laughs> Good evening, welcome. Good evening. Where is your husband? My husband, I hope there is no problem. I'm asking you, where is your husband? That's why I'm here and you're asking me stupid questions. Where is your husband? I'm sorry, Chief. My husband hasn't been home since he left for the farm for the past three days. And my husband has not slept outside the house before. And the situation is getting me worried. All right. So that is his plans. So that's just his trick. So he took money from me and disappeared. Huh? My husband never told me he borrowed many money from you. He did not tell me he borrowed money from you, Chief. So what are you insinuating, woman? So what you're telling me right now is that I am, I, I am lying or what? That I'm a liar? Is that what you're saying? Chief, I didn't call you a liar. I only said that my husband did not tell me he borrowed money from you. Because he tells me everything before he even does them. He never said anything like that to me. Oh, Shut up. Your husband borrowed money from me and he gave me that land near the market as a collateral. You understand? So now that he has disappeared to the thin air, that land automatically belongs to me now. Until he reappears. Which land? Chief, that land is our only source of livelihood. Nobody, not even you, will touch that land. That is my husband's land, and nobody will take that land from us. Okay. I am Chief Oliver, and I'm not nobody. 
I am not anybody. I am Jeff Oliver. For your information, I'm taking that land until your husband reappears to give me back the money he brought from me. You have to wait for my husband to come back. Definitely we we'll settle all this. But not that land, Chief. Leave that land alone. Not that land. to catch us. Catch me. Don't worry about that. I can always give the excuse that I have come to see your father for something. Hey, 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 hey. Chief, please, I, I, I don't like this so. Don't come and spoil things for me. I'm not yet married. I'm still single. If 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 they catch it catches us here now, my bad price will reduce. Is that why you are scared? There is something about you, you know. You see, whenever you are angry, you look more beautiful. Something tells me that you are going to marry me instead of that stupid old American. <laughs> Try anything close to that and you will be a dead man. My father is going to kill you. Why? Why would your father kill his best friend? Huh? Am I not a man? He can kill me. Hey, best friend. Don't worry. When I return home from farm today, I'm going to tell my father that his best friend and his best daughter are doing something. Hey, no. Maka, please, please. Don't ever dream of that. Biko, do, do you want that man to murder me in my sleep? Biko, don't even in your widest imagination. Please, Biko. Then leave. Leave here, Mr. Oh. Leave here, man. Don't catch us. See, nobody will catch us, eh? I just come for us to have a little mm -hmm. kiss. Chief, I'm not going to be able to kill you. Nobody is. Chief, I'm not going to be able to Leave. I don't, and I don't want to go to this extent. I will shout to if you don't leave here. I will shout. Oh! I will. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Shout people will gather here now. Please. Okay. Let me take this. Ah! 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 Right, right. Nah. He's watching you He never fails He never sleeps Or dig around Can't you leave me alone? What are you looking for again in my farmland? Kelechi or someone who will be a nobody? Am I the only man in this? Can't you let me be? My love, 
Wait, wait. What did you just say? My love. Oh, to quack in on the Love, who back walk? Who is your love? My love. I know my duty as a woman. Eh? And I will never renege on doing them. Your duty as a woman? Eh? And what is your duty as a woman? My love. I'm here because I know it is my duty to take care of your stomach. Eh? I did not know. Okay. Oh, you brought food for me. <laughs> Give it to me. Mm. Ah! Mama Kubi! Yes? You threw away the food I specially prepared for you to the ground? Oh. Bam! And that is how I've been throwing all the poison, poison, all the rubbish you've been bringing to me. Let me tell you something, eh? Nothing on this earth will make me to eat any rubbish or poison prepared by a pest like you. Change it! Onukubi, you call me a pest? Yes, you, change it! Onukubi, oh, I'm not a pest because I love you, eh? I'm a pest because I love you and I'm ready to show it to you! Hi, Kelechi, don't you understand, Kelechi? I do not need your love. I am wrong number. Take your love to somebody else. I have my own love. I have a woman I cherish, a woman I have given my heart to. I do not love you. Go and look for another person to love you because, oh, oh. I am wrong number. She loves you, eh? Yes, ne. And you cherish her? Mm-hmm. Onukube, you are mad. Mua. Onukube, you are mad. You show you're stupid. Hey, hey. Kelechi Makachuku, eh? If not for the fact that, Mwogi Akanti now, I slap you now, they'll say, ah, Onukube beat a woman, eh? I would have closed your eye with a slap. Idiot. Who are you? Are you my girlfriend? That that you talk to me like that? Who are you to insult me? I don't know about you. Insult you? Yes! No, Onukube. I have not insulted you. I'm only telling you the truth. One thing you should know is, I'm from this village. And I know what every other girl in this village has been saying about your Amaka. <laughs> Kelechi, Kelechi, I know what you want to do. I don't have time for that. I know you want to start your round of gossips. Eh? Radio without battle. BBC of our village. That is what you want to do now. I am not ready. Leave me and Amaka alone. Leave us alone. Well, I don't have anything more to say to you. Because it is obvious that you are a fool. Onukube, you are a fool because out of all the men in this village, you are the only one who is yet to see that your Amaka is a girl that any man in this village can have any time and any day. Stupid man. Stupid man. In fact, just get out. Come on, get out. Check, check your leg. Eh? Idiot. What's wrong? Amaka Kuma. What did I do? Amaka, you of all people. Hey. Oh. Amaka Guam you Kwadobi. Amaka, I have finally found out what you have been doing behind my back. Guwa! I have finally found out that you was in Oboda Unketa. What nonsense are you talking about? Oh, oh, oh. You see, because of the money I asked you to give me, that's why you're trying to cover up. Oh, about to turn that fire, Gideba. Shut up your mouth, idiot. Yes. You think I've not heard? You think I've not heard how you have become the easiest and cheapest girl in this community? You, Goma, the cheapest girl in this in this community. Onukube, eh? Onukube, you don't listen to gossip, eh? Every day Kahari will come to this village and gossip to you, listen to them. Don't you know I love you? Eh, Onukube? 
Tina, I love you. Nene, man, you're a man from Ginani. You're not good. To think that many men will come to me in this village and I will reject them all because of you. Man, I'm from Ginani. Ine, mami, ine, gelas. Onukube, Onukube, you've broken my heart. Wait. Uh, are you are you saying that you, you have not been sleeping with men in this village? Why would I do that? What on earth will make me do that? I love you. I love you so much. I can't do it. I can't cheat on you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But you too, you make life difficult for me. Uh, you make things difficult for me. Every time you you, you you want money from me, you just be shouting, shouting. It's, it's, it's because of it's because of that thing I heard that I, I refuse to give you the, the, the money I was supposed to give you. It's because of that thing. It's true, but I need the money. But it's not enough reason for me to cheat on you. Eh? I, I cannot cheat on you, even though the money is important. Eh? Well, uh, I love you, but but uh, I don't like the fact that you accused me. Uh, you actually accused me that I am now a, a harlot in this village. Let me let me go and tell my father that you called me a harlot. Don't 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 tell, don't, don't tell your, your your father because. Don't, don't. I will tell my father. Don't. I will tell my father. Leave me alone. But that means I, I I don't even understand. How am I, how am I even sure that you love me, sir? That you you love me? Or you could not know? I love you. No, 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 no. I love you. You love me just like that. Or we could not know? You be my baby. I love you. Mm. Just that one. You won't hold me. I'll hold you. Look at me, Is is that the way you hold somebody you love? You know I'm shy. You I don't like doing thing. this thing like this. I we'll see in the house. Okay, I'll come to your house. I love the matter. Oh my God! 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 Hey, Papa, I'm sorry, I forgot. I forgot to get this snow before we left for the farm this morning. But I promise, first thing tomorrow morning, I will get you your snow. Shut up that to your mouth. Who are you giving that advice? Huh? Something I said to you to go and do for me two days ago. You are telling me that tomorrow morning. Papa, I'm sorry now. Okay, I'll go and get you your snow after eating. Try and sit down there and see what I will do to you. I will make this to, this after so comfortable for you. Huh? Nani, what is it? Huh? Eh? We've spent the whole day at the farm. We're all tired. Biko, let this girl eat her food first. Tomorrow morning, she will go and get your snuff. Woman, better stay out of this. I never intend dressing a little girl in this house. Eh? And that is what your daughter is gradually turning into. Ah, Papa, eh? I'm not lazy. In this house. Eh? Papa, I'm not lazy. I'm not lazy at all. Yeah, okay, give me the bottle. Let me go and get you your snuff. Listen. Go there. I have already given my bot uh, snuff bottle to uh, Nina Maria. Go, she will give you my snuff. Eh? Oh, Lama. Oh, yeah. Proceed. Ah, Papa. Ah. Go from Kevin and the poor girl cannot eat before going out. Oh, 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 bro, where are you? You are telling the student to be late. Jesus! Papa! 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 Papa
souls as possible for you. The more souls I get, the more powerful I become. My spirit, grant me permission to get the soul that is waiting for me in my house for your food. us granite and bread for us to eat. Let me get you water. you just do? Take that food away from me. Take that your broken food away from me. Give me what I need. What I really, really need. Mama, what do you really want? Give Chief Odiva what he's asking for. Give it to him and we will be free. Then our lives will come back to normal. Mama, are we ever going to be normal again? Someone in this village attacked our family with poison. In one night, we lost Papa and Titus. The poison caused you to go blind. Mama, look at us very well. Are we ever going to be normal again? Give Chief Oliver what he wants. I keep repeating and repeating myself. He will make our lives better if he gets what he wants. But you won't listen. Our lives getting back to normal is in your hands. Yes. In your hands, Obi Naka. Mama, please stop. Please stop. 
Chief Oliver and his friend have nothing good in mind for us. He was never Papa's friend when Papa was alive. And that has it changed just because Papa is dead. Give him what he wants. Give him what he wants. Someone will be free. Someone will get back to normal. I want to see. I want to eat. I want to. I want to be my own self. Give him what he wants. Give him what he wants. I keep telling you, give him what he wants. I want to see. I want to live a normal life. Where, where are you? Where are you going to? Come back here. Where are you? Come back here. Come on, Aloma. Come back here, Aloma. Give him. Give him what he wants. What's the end of all this? Why are you wasting my time? Chief. Chief, please. I beg you in the name of God. Help me and my family. What are you talking about? If you want me to help you and your family, all you need to do is to do what I ask you to do. Eh? I'm in terms of organization. What is wrong with you? Oh, I am finished. Chief, please. Don't do this to me. You and my husband attend the secondary school together. Hmm? Chief, please, now. Don't do this. Oh, okay. News caster. When you finish with your news, then you use the door. Oh no, Chief. This Chief now, my husband will surely die if I don't get back to the hospital with 20,000 naira deposit. The daughter asked me to bring. Please save his life. What are you talking about? Just take off your clothes. Let me tell you what I want. That's all. If you don't want to do that, then I will call my boss to send you out of this house. Please. Chief, no man other than my husband has touched me. Please, Chief, don't do this now. And... Snake! Tiger! Okay, Chief. Chief! Okay, Chief. You can have your way with me. Do whatever you want with me, Chief. But please, don't send me away from here. We take 20,000 naira for my husband's medical bills. Please. Oh, you please leave me in the room. I'm going to go. 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 You are highly privileged. You should be very happy that a man of my caliber want to touch your poverty and eczema really infested body. Huh? Have you taken your bath today? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. What if you are on that way that you sure they are very clean? Yes, Chief. I don't want, I don't want smell to hit my nostril while having sex with you. I talk with me in Lucy. I talk with me in Lucy. Huh? You're sure? Yes, Chief. Okay. Why are you standing there looking at me? Why are you, what are you doing? Chief, show me your bedroom. What? I should show you my bedroom. Why? Imagine. Because I just want to have sex with you and help you. You think you are big enough to enter my bedroom? Do you know the kind of bed I use? Do you know what I use in my bedroom? So I want to destroy my bedroom. You! Ah, which means after using you in my bedroom, then I'll call the fumigators to fumigate. That's what it means. Call the fumigators to fumigate. Let's go to the bedroom. Let's go to the bedroom. Chief Bikon. Hey. Chief Bikon. Hey. Chief. Hey.
Oh, bagus. Ana. Oh, gosh. I'm going to go to the school. Hey. God never sees. My mom, my queen, why are you rushing to this seat? Please stop running, eh? Just climb on my back, let me give you a lift wherever you want to go. Eh? Samantha, get out of my way now. I don't have time for your nonsense, just leave. Oh, come on, you see me. My nonsense? Eh? Uh, anytime you look at me with, with anger in your face, my heart starts to burst for joy. Samantha. Leave my way now before I do something I will regret. Just leave. <laughs> what is that that you will do and regret? If it is for you to kiss me, few friends do it. Just, just kiss me. Do it. You want a kiss, eh? Oh, oh, oh yes. And I'm just kiss me and let me go to heaven. I, I brush my mouth more than five times today. Because I know something good will happen to me. Please kiss me. Go okay. Ahead. I'll kiss you. Uh -huh. Just close your eyes. Why? Oh! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you want to close your eyes and kiss like those what people do in their movies? Sharp girl. You know they say that kissing is sweeter when one closes his his or her eyes. Okay. <laughs> I will do it. Uh, See, close your eyes. Your time is running. Now. Okay. Oh, yeah, close your eyes. Uh-huh. Ah. 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 Watch this gate one more time and see what will happen to you. I want to see Chief Oliver! Young girl, if you still love the color of your skin, just turn around and leave this place now. Or do you want me to descend on you? Look, there is nothing any of you can do to me. I am not going to leave this place until I see Chief Oliver. Where is he? Come on, we'll leave those out of here now! If you can change your look here, if you can change your look here, if you can swear any boo, I'll swear any boo! Leave this place!
Your father was a very useless and foolish man. A man that allowed his life to be ruled by poverty. And I see you taken the same way. It will be so wrong because if you do, the same poverty will kill you. My family was poisoned in one night. I only escaped because God wanted me to leave. My mother is suffering from near blindness due to the same poison she ingested. Chief, why do you want to take the only property we have in my family? Why? You know the worst mistake that happened, you know, concerning this issue? Was that you narrowly escaped that? I don't know how you escaped the day your father and your brother was spot. You're supposed to be part of it. Assuming you were, I don't think we will be, you know, talking about land here. So you are angry that I did not eat out of the poison? I poisoned your family. Yes, Oloma. I poisoned your family deep. Yes, I did. I killed your useless father because he refused to do what I wanted him to do. You murdered my father and my brother. You, Chief, you! Yes, you think I never knew? You think I never knew you killed them? Everyone knows you are evil. And even if they pretend to be ignorant of it, I know that you are an evil man, Chief. I know! Yes, I did, my dear. I killed the idiot. And you know what? If you don't give me the papers of that land, I will send you to the same place I sent him. That is the only reason. That is the only reason why I'm keeping you alive. I knew you had a hand in the mother of my brother and my father. Now that you have confirmed it clearly, I'm going to make sure you pay for your crime, even if I die in the process. <laughs> I am shaking. My body, I am shaking. I'm so afraid. Fool. Now listen to me. Your father, your useless father, caused me pain. Your useless father challenged me the way no other man, no other woman has ever challenged me. He was the only one that stood face to face to challenge me. You know one thing that I regret so much? I don't know why I killed him with poison. I would have killed him slowly, slowly, so that he would feel my rot. And now that I've seen that you are like him, I am going to kill you slowly. I am going to kill you slowly until you feel the pain and beg death to come and take you. Chief, you can never break me down. You can never break me down and you will never ever get my father's land. I will make sure I will make sure everybody in this village and beyond know about you and the wickedness of your heart. You see? Huh. You want to take you to war with me? <laughs> you want to battle with me? <laughs> you are worse than a cockroach. You are worse than a rat. Now I tell you something. Go out there. Tell them that I say that I killed your father. Tell them that I told you that I killed your father. Announce it everywhere. Let's know what comes out of it. Let's know who wins. Idiot. Take this thing out of my sight. Take it out of my sight. Idiot. Spirit of God. you see? God will punish you. You see? God will judge you. The wrath of God will come upon you. You see? You will see?
Nothing they mean! She doesn't she does uh, uh, understand English. Aida, she doesn't understand English. This girl has a stone heart. Aida, she doesn't understand English. This girl has a stone heart. Uh, Mama, that is what happened though. I had to go back to my house and spend a long time. Cleaning away the sand your daughter poured into my mouth. Sand, what? Mm -hmm. Sand, sand. You mean she poured sand, sand inside your mouth? Mama, I don't know. This girl will not kill me. Huh? Eh? How can she continue to reject a handsome man like you, eh, Samanja? Huh? I don't know. Mama, I don't know. In fact, I don't understand. Well, well, let me ask you one question. Are, are you very handsome now? Huh? Ini, your, ini, your kutigo is the most standing now. <laughs> Mama, let me tell you. I am now very handsome. In fact, since you've lost your sight, I have grown so handsome that very soon I might be walking on the street covering my face. Hey, 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 hey. Samanja, handsome man, <laughs> eh? But I can't understand this, my daughter. How can she reject you? Eh? Reject your love. Reject your handsomeness. Oh. I will kill that girl when she comes back. I'm a boy. I will kill her. Oh, I don't know why she should keep rejecting you. Eh? Oh. Kill you now. Huh? I'm a menu. Ah, come on, Mama, please, oh. take it easy on her. Don't beat her too much so that she doesn't get injured. Samanja will never marry a different wife, oh. Uh, <laughs> and uh, uh, once you're done dealing with her, mm -hmm. this bottle of malt will be yours. Samanja! Obia. Obia. What are you doing in my father's compound? Eh? What are you doing here? Ah, come on, Jesunike. Ah, come on, Jesunike. Come down, my love. What have I done to you to deserve you uh, being angry with me? Huh? You both sent into my mouth instead of a kiss. So I'm here because of the love I have for you. Huh? Look, eh? By the time I am done with you, you will never come near this compound. Hey! I will so break and scatter this your head. Just wait for me. Oh, mama! 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 Oh, Samanja the handsome man, you're rejecting him. Oh no, ma, if we see you, if we see you. Oh no, ma. Hey! Chime, can do it for GC where Kote. Eh? Nenu, handsome Samanja. Hey! Oblong when the younger would have fallen for the boy. Send for us. Boys? Yes, Chiefs. I want that land. That's Oloma's father's land and need it. It's, it's fast becoming a matter of life and death. Chief, why don't you just take out that stupid and loud mouthed girl out of the way so that you can get what you want? Isn't she too small a fly for us to continue to condone? She's even lesser than a fly. But I want you to understand something. I'm a smooth operator. I don't want that to happen. I don't want us to kill her now. Because if we do, everybody will suspect us. And that will jeopardize my plans concerning that land. I don't want that to happen now because of the important nature of that land to me. I need that land desperately. Considering the number of people I've buried there. Considering the number of people I've buried there. If we don't get that land and someone else too, our secret will open up. Chief. Speak, speak. You are the greatest man I've ever met 
observed. And you know I would gladly lay down my life for you. But Chief, I'm confused. As you told Oloma that we poisoned our family. When you know she will surely expose us. Let me come this way. The man you are serving have the life of a crocodile, the unique life of a crocodile. He strike when he wants to strike. He strike when it's necessary that he should strike. I want you to know there's an error, a very big error, and that error is that we did not clear the entire family. Yes. As human we did. That land will automatically turn to community land. And it will be easier for me to get it from the king. Yes. But now we did not kill all. The land is still there. And the only person to go for that land is all normal. That girl cannot do that, Chief. She's even more headstrong than her father. Yes, she is very strong. But I want to assure you that she will hand over the land to me very soon. Uh, uh, I'm so sorry, Chief. Please. Uh, I don't want this to sound as if I don't comprehend what you're saying. Uh, but uh, how is that ever going to happen? I know it's beyond your comprehension. But I want you to understand that your boss is a bad guy and making possibilities possible. Now listen to me. You see with your eyes when it will happen. I set Oloma up when I told her that I am responsible for the poisoning of the father and the brother. It was an intentional act. You will see with your eyes when she will hand the land over to me and for free, you will say. Go back to your positions. Thank you. God never sleeps. Chukwa diga rangura. God never sleeps. No, 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 no. God never sleeps. She's Mama, you. what did you just do? This was all the food we had in the house. May God punish that your mouth if you utter that nonsense again. What kind of food? What kind of food is this that, that you, you, you put for me to eat? Is this the kind of food that I used to eat when your father was alive? Is it? Mama, I suffered and slaved for us to get this food to eat. Why have you decided to make things difficult for me, Mama? Why? Don't help me. And Yolanda Maka, don't help me, Nifa now. Why? Just give me my husband's land to sell so I can take myself to a good hospital and treat the blindness that has befallen me. Yes, Mama, I thank you. Mama, never. Never will I stand by and watch Papa's land being sold to Chief Oliver or anybody else. Hi! When Papa was alive, he begged me not to sell his land. That that's the only land we have. Mama, I will never do such a thing. Never! Mm -hmm. I can see clearly now. I can see clearly now even though I'm blind. Uzo can now You hate me. You go see gone way. It shows that you hate me. You want me to die. Okay, I understand. You want me to die, okay? You want to keep the land. Uso Buadiro. Sometimes I wonder. I wonder if you are not the person that poisoned that food. Mama, what, what did you just say? You heard me. People have been saying it, and I know it, and within you, you know that you're the one that poisoned us. But, Kowalum, explain to me why you were not here when we all ate the poison food. You conveniently disappeared. <laughs> Mama, please, 
Stop saying these words. I beg of you, please. I, I will say whatever I want to say. I will say it over and over again. When he gave me, I will keep talking. Mama, Chief Oliver confessed before me today that he poisoned everybody and that he killed Papa and Titus and that he's also responsible for your blind state. My dear wicked. Oh, begin watch a Seattle. You're a very wicked child. Look at what you're saying. Nemo says, saying I'm a saying evil things about that honorable. Oh, is it more one Honorable man that has been taking care of me. You have refused to let me enjoy the kindness that that man wants to bestow on me. Give me one. Ibala Jo. Mama. Never will I ever imagine that you will speak to me like this. But it's okay. I will always love and protect you and stand by you no matter what. Biko! Don't protect me. In the name of God, don't protect me. I don't need you to protect me. You are an evil child. You will continue to be evil. I don't need you around me. You should just get away from me. Evil one. Don't protect me. I don't need anything from you. Just leave me alone. Leave me alone. Don't protect me. I don't want. I don't want. I don't want evil. Wicked soul. Wicked soul. I don't want Wicked child. I'm on this Mufa, Mufa. I am Chief Oliver, the strongest man in the whole world. Are you and I representative of my subject and slaves? You are nothing but a foot. Power of a strong and powerful, that is the power of Give me power. Give me power. Power of a strong one. Oh, that is it. I love that. The power. That is good. I love that. Dead and gone. 
but Papa, the man who murdered you and my brother confessed before me today. <laughs> you taught me never to close my eyes against evil and corruption. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, I make you this solemn promise. I shall not rest until justice prevails, Papa. <laughs> and until Chief Oliver pays for his crime. Papa, please stand by me. <laughs> Come to my aid, Papa. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, I cannot do this alone. Papa, please. <laughs> help me, Papa, help me. Papa. <laughs> Papa. <laughs> When you're passing through trials of pain, God is there. He will see you through. Just be still. When you're passing through trials of pain, God never sleeps. He never slumber. Hey, oh, Chukwadi Gararura. He's watching you. He's See, Kelechi, before you start to look like a monkey or, or a baboon, that's none of my business. All I know is that I want you to give me my balance now so that I can go and settle my boys. That's what I'm asking for you, for, 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 from you. They're waiting for me. I'm mad you have punished you and your boys. You are mad. Take it to your... You've not even done... You've, you've not done any job for me. And you're busy talking about paying your, your boys' balance. You are mad. Eh? Oh. See, don't try me, yo. Afima, don't try me in this village. Don't even try me because I will deal with you. So, so what are you trying to say now? That you don't give me the balance? Is that what you are trying to say? Hey, hey, hey. I don't even know why I'm standing here talking to a fool like you. Eh? I don't know. But I dare you, Afima. I dare you to tell anybody in this village that I sent you to beat your own cousin up. <laughs> you know me now. I will deny it. And once I do, everybody will believe me. Because everybody in, the, in this village thinks that you're a madman. And yeah. you know that you're a madman. Yeah. So don't believe me. So don't, don't try it. Oh! Oh, it has come to that, Abi. It has come to that, Kelechi. Watch your back. You're the next victim. You heard me. Watch your back. Don't worry. I'll get come out, back to you. Please get out. See him. You can only talk to a woman, but you cannot fight just, 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 just a man like you. Even one small scratch you could not put on his skin. Stupid boy. With his skinny leg, it's your. Huh? Small, just small job, eh? Yes, Chief Ford. Thunder fire, Chief, talk Idiot. Okay, be. Red cap, Chief Knife. Odinaka, you had the gods to come to my compound. You had the gods after what you did. You had the gods to come to my compound. What? I don't want to bug Please, Onukube, please calm down first. Calm down. Let us discuss like men. Like my job, man. Please. Get it! I should come down! If that you want to come to the world, you can go and come down. Hey. Useless old man, okay? We, the walls have Red fear. cap chief, second in command in his cabinet. Useless man. Ordinary. Got right hand, 
Sleeping with a girl old enough to be your daughter, granddaughter. You were sleeping with her now, I should calm down. Did you not see your mate? I know here. Okay, we. He be the quagi. There, he 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 go and calm down. That is why I'm here. I am ready to settle you. I mean, any damage I have done on that guy, I promise I will settle you. Hey, why did I not remember that? I should be shouting. Hey, that I should be telling the whole. Oh, my Come and see what Odinaka chief, second in command, Igwe's cabinet, red cap weather. Come and see what he, what he has done. Oh, caught sleeping with his best friend's daughter, a girl old enough to be his granddaughter. That is what a red cap chief, second in command. Come and hear. Please, please, please. Are you considering my position in this unit? You know, I am next to the king. Mm. If anything happens to the King, I, I, I will put this next person to be on that throne. Why do you want to shame me in this eh. By the time eh, I finish with you, if I let me tell you the truth, eh, you will pay. You will pay for every pain you have cost me. I, I'm for the shame you have brought upon me. I'm ready to say about Paul. Get out of this place I, now. I, I promise I will leave. But promise me that you will not let any other ear hear this. Because let me let something between you and me alone. Eh. I, I promise you I will settle. I will pay anything, even with my blood. Say that, bro. I will do what I promise you that. You don't want to go. You don't want to go. But then, there. Give me the fact that you there. You will have stayed. Let me separate your head from your body. Okay? They will not see their men, so. They will not see our old women like, like them. You did not see women in your category. Get out of there. What I can which you looking at hotel. The guy now go and calm down. Wait, you would have waited, I would have separated your head from your body. That's how you put, wear red cap, you go about confusing people. Okay, now my rural. Mbenguku here now, idiot. So heavily. Amaka, you're here. Hey, Amaka, honestly, I escaped by the skin of my own teeth. I didn't know that that young man is a, is a madman. Hey, could you believe that the man chased me out of his compound with a very sharp cutlass? Honestly, I could see it in his red eyes. If he had caught me, eh, he would have chopped my head off and dismembered my body. That means he did not, Chief, that means he did not agree to your settlement. Amaka, are you mad? I am telling you that the man chased me out of his copper with a cutler. You are asking me whether he, he agreed to my agreement or not. Amaka, let me say it in black and white. He refused to agree to any settlement. Chief, I am finished. What would I tell my father that cost Onukube not to marry me again? God, Chief. Chief, he has, you have finished me. Chief, I warned you. I warned you, Chief. Mm. Chief, I now you remember uh, when, when, when you were enjoying it, when you were singing my name like a parrot, did you remember that Onukube would eventually uh, marry you? Eh? Now it is my fault, but you have forgotten that you, you, you enjoyed it. Chief, don't shut me up. Chief, don't shut me up. You, you caused all this mess. I want you not to come to my house today, but you, you insisted on coming. Chief, you have to do something. You just have to do something about this. I don't want Onukube to go tell my parents now that, that me and you we are doing something. Don't let him to go tell them about us now. Don't worry. I, I will go and see him again. I will convince him and make sure that he collects the money I want to give to him. Onukube, take your money. <laughs> Chief, please, please don't make me laugh. How, how would you mean? Chief, Onukube will not take your money. We don't have many men of honor in this village and outside anymore. Onukube would rather die than to let you bribe him with money. Hey! Then I am finished. Amaka, I am finished. That's why I'm saying you should act fast. Because... Bob Pianoso, chief. Bob Pianoso, you better act fast. I don't want anything to happen to my marriage, yo. I must marry Onukube, chief. Act fast. Go and tell him. Do what... Any how you want to do it, I don't care. I don't care how you intend to do it. All I know is, go and act fast. Convince Onukube. Go and act fast. We need. Ngabe no mwadu 
Blessing, the blessing that will make me to continue to be the strongest and the most powerful man in the kingdom. That will make me get whatever that is my heart desire. That is what I need. Tonight, tonight I want to serve you in a extraordinary way. I want to serve you I tell him, if I go for that, come fake go for that. I want to give you your dinner. The dinner of blood. The dinner of blood. Send me your eggs so that I can proceed to service tonight. Send me your eggs. 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 I am no Lead me to the one that I have chosen to fail upon tonight. Lead me to the ones that have loved. Upon your plate. Lead me. Lead me. Lead me. Uh, go home. You know, I don't want your husband to get to know that you are not at home. Hmm. No, I don't want his trouble. That drunk, he comes home completely drunk. Even if I didn't sleep in the house tonight, he wouldn't notice so. Ha! <laughs> Serious? Hey, no. No, don't worry, the drunkenness is of my own gain. <laughs> Hope you will see tomorrow or either after tomorrow. What do you think? Hmm. For sure, why not? As long as you keep giving me money, I'm always yours. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, I will do. I will do as you said. Yeah. Alright, take care of yourself. Bye bye. Bye bye. I wash your memory. I wash your memory. You will never remember what happened here tonight. Never in your life.
Oloma, why didn't you come to my house to see me instead of standing out here? No, 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 no. See, I want to tell you something. Let's discuss it here. I wouldn't want anybody to overhear us. What is the matter again? It looks like you've been crying all day. Is it about, about your mom's health? See, Noye, I think I know who poisoned my family. I think I know who killed my father and my brother and snatched away joy from my family. Not again. Not again. Ha. The last time you talked about this, you suspended Chief Oliver. Even though the old villain knows how he came to your aid, how you and your family when you were poisoned. Who do you want to suspend this time around? Are you done? Yes, I am done. Okay. okay. See, earlier on, I suspected Chief Oliver. But what so many of you don't know in this village is that that man is very evil. He's an evil incarnate. It was only my father that knew who his true personality was before he died. Oh, I have heard all of this over and over again. Come up with something new, please. No, you see, he confessed to me that he poisoned my family and that he regrets that I did not eat from the dinner, that I would have been dead by now. So, how you want me to believe now is that Chief Oliver confessed to you that he is the one that poisoned your family, right? Yes, he confessed to me in his own house. Really? How did he do it? He invited you to his house and has his guards to prepare a special dinner for you and told you how he poisoned your family. Yes, yeah. see, you have to believe me. Oh. You have to believe me because I. And what, Oloma? What? Ha! I am your friend and I will give you a friendly advice. Forget about your past. Forget about your past. Go and do something and move on with your life and stop thinking about what happened six months ago. Well, yeah, how can I move on with my life when the killer of my father and my brother is walking about on the street freely? How? Huh? Well, you know what you will do now? Go and sleep. I think you need to clear off your head. Clear off your head and move on with your life. Please excuse me. Mention that name again. I will lay a curse on you and your generation. Okay, I'm so sorry. I don't know what came over me. You don't know what came over me? Yes. Amaka, how could you? Amaka, I gave you everything. I gave you my heart, my life. And the best way you could pay me was to allow a man old enough to be your father. To have sex with you in the open like a dog, look at that. He, com he confused and, and deceived me. He made me to lose my senses. I didn't even know when I, I, I opened for him. I didn't know. Please forgive me. You didn't know when you lost your mind. He confused you. You didn't know when you opened your legs. It, it will happen you again. You are idiot. I want a cheap prostitute. That's what you are. You do not know. Don't worry. I'm going to expose what you and that shameless ego took in me. What you people, that shameless act to the entire village. I'm going to do that. Please don't do it. 
Don't do it. My father will scare me alive if he finds out that I had anything to do with Chief Odnaka. Please. Please don't look at you. Come on! Don't near me. If you, if, 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 you, if you talk to me again, eh? let me tell you something. Before the end of the day, eh? before the end of the day, the whole village will hear it. How, how shameful you have been. Cherewere, cheap prostitute. Or Hear yourself talk. Hear yourself talk. How do I know that? Maybe Ota again agazi mo neke neke kari neke kari chere wele. Idiot. Come on, get out. Touch me again. On that phone. Come on. that this girl has brought upon me. Eh? How would I face the world and tell them that my fiancé left me to sleep with an old man? Hey, People would just laugh at me. The whole world would turn me into a caricature. No. But I must find a way to make them pay for causing me such pain. I must. Hello, ma. Sorry, I kept you waiting. Uh, uh, I just, I'm already late for a meeting at the station, and I have no other option than to hurry and go. That's fine, sir. I'm not going to take much of your time. I just came to tell you something about the poison attack on my family and the death of my father and brother. Uh, I'm sorry about everything. I am really, really sorry. Especially the fact that we've not been able to catch the person who poisoned your family's dinner six months after the event happened. We're trying our best, you know. But one day, one day we are going to catch the person or group of persons that did that. I've caught the person, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. As a matter of fact, he confessed to me himself. Is that a joke or something? Ah, sir. Why would I joke about something like that? I can never joke about something that changed the course of my life. Something that wiped away joy from my face. Sir, Chief Oliver is the person that poisoned my family. But only managed to take my father and my brother and made my mother blind. Inspector, he told me so himself. Please calm down. Calm down, please. Are you telling me that Chief Oliver told you actually that he's the person who poisoned your family? Yes, sir, he did. Right to my face. Where and when did this thing happen? And who were witnesses? Yesterday, sir, in his compound, in presence of his guard, he taunted me. He told me that there is nothing I can do to him. And that if I don't give him the land, I will be the next to go. Aloma. Sir. Have you been sleeping well these past days? Yes, sir. I've been sleeping very well. Are you sure? I'm very sure, sir. Are you sure what you just told me about Chief Oliver is not a mere fabrication out of the issues you might have with him? Are you sure? Uh, sir, are you trying to say you don't believe what I'm saying? No, I'm not saying I don't believe you. No. All I'm saying is that you need to go home now and rest. I shall kick off investigations into the allegations you just leveled against Chief Oliver. By the way, mm -hmm. I'll do that immediately. There are no allegations, sir. He told me that himself. You can ask his guard. He was there. Oh, no problem. Hmm? No problem, my okay. Trust me when I say I am going to find out the truth in this matter. Hmm? Okay, sir. You can now go. God never sleeps. Chukwati Garalura. God never sleeps. No, 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 no. God never sleeps. Hey, he's watching you Papa. When you're passing through Try as a mate God is dead Yes, please ah. 
day, sir? A uh, good day, young lady. How are you today? I'm fine. Uh, I don't know you. Uh, I'm not from this village. Someone directed me to you when I asked for the best farm worker around. So they mentioned you. Oh, I see. You want me to work for you on the farm? Yes. I'm from the neighboring village. And my father has several plots of lands. And he makes hands from them. So, the people around there mentioned you. They said you're one of the most hard-working men in this neighborhood. Uh, I'm so sorry. Uh, I'm not in the right mood to work on any farm for now, please. And maybe I'll advise you to look for someone else, please. Oh. Why? Are you sick or something? I am not sick. I just simply said, my mind is too weak to accommodate me to work on any farm. I never said I'm sick. Okay, okay. What if my father pays you three times of the normal wages of a farm hand? Would that make you change your mind? Come on, I said no. Did you hear me? Which part of the don't do you not understand? I said no. What is happening? I don't know what is wrong with you. No men of these days. I don't know why they don't want to make their life meaningful to the society. Eh? Anyways, I'm sorry to bother you. Okay? Um, excuse me. Oh, wait, 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 please, 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 please. I, I'm just so sorry for the outburst. I, I, I just don't know what, you know, came over me. Just that I've been weighed down, you know, by so many problems in my mind. Please, I'm so sorry for the outburst. Why wouldn't I want to walk? Why? Please, I'm still willing to, to work if you still hire me. I'm so sorry for the outburst, please. Ah, Maka, who is after you? That's why on the mountain. We need to run away from this village. Why? Chief, I saw Anu Kupe today and he said he's going to tell everybody, tell the youths and everybody that me and you, he saw us doing something. So? Chief, you're saying so? Do you want the village people to come and catch me and you? Chief, let's run away. Amaka, calm down. Calm down. Anu Kupe is not going to tell anybody. He's not going to do anything. Uh -uh. Eh? Look, let me tell you. If Anu Kupe wanted to tell somebody, he would have done that since yesterday. Instead of waiting up till this moment. For him to wait up to this moment, that means he is not going to tell anybody. Chief, you're talking like you f you're very, very sure that something will be done and I'm here believing you. Chief, see, let me tell you, if you don't want to run away, then give me the money. I will run away. Now, now. Hey, I'm not can money. I'm, not can, as I, I'm speaking with you now. Something is going on somewhere. Onukube is being handled by, I don't want to say, until you see the outcome of what has happened. Chief, are you sure? Amaka, I am sure. You know what? We are going to celebrate our victory at that joint this evening. Chief, I don't believe you, Chief. See, I want to run away. I want to, Chief, give me the money. Give me the money. Let me use it and run away. If you cannot run away now, I can open the map. I can run away. Amaka, baby. Are you very oh. no, 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 sure? the shop this evening. Thank you. Let me see. He <laughs> like beautiful. He like can me hot jaw. I do we go and. Mba. Eba. Ibe wa. We dey go. Ah. Don't worry. We will celebrate the success of what is going on now. Ah, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> my baby. Oh. He put up, put up, um. Hmm. Hey, shake my sh. Hey, ya. Hey, the four of you. Come here now. No, we are on our way to stream to get some water for our parents. We need to get there quickly. 
Are you mad? Please, I'll leave us alone. Will you keep quiet? Please, I'll leave us alone. You know, will you keep quiet? You know the person who wants to see you. Please, or do you want to die here and now? We don't want to talk to you or see anyone in your car. Let's just go. We don't want to talk to you. We don't want to talk to you. Where's my Antonia? Leave them, leave them! They are rats. I just want to see if there's any way I can help them. But well, they are rats. Not even sensible rats, but senseless rats. Let's go. God never sleeps. Chokwa digara rora. God never sleeps. No, 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 no. God never sleeps. Hey, he's watching you. We will pass through trials of hate. God is there. He will see you through. Chief, honorable man, eh? I don't know the things you brought for me, but the way that your boys were dropping it on the ground, Igbidim, Igbadam, I can just imagine that they are heavy, heavy things. <laughs> eh? I know you, eh? Honorable man, I'm sure they are all falling. You know hey, God bless you, God bless you. You know what I can do? <laughs> but is there anything I do in life? He's touching lives. <laughs> You're a good man. God will continue to bless you and replenish your pocket. It's my ministry. <laughs> chief, chief, chief. Without you, where would we be? Eh? Mother, I got no money. Mother, killer. What are you doing in my father's compound? Eh? What are you doing in my father's compound? What are you doing? Levi's is nothing but a child. Please don't don't, don't touch this little child. <laughs> evil man, you are so evil. You are very very evil. So you have the guts to come to my father's compound after killing my father and my brother and making my mother half blind. You shut up, shut up. You're the one that is evil. Eh? Can you not see all the things that that, that chief brought for us? Eh? He's there helping us and you're here calling a good man an horrible man evil. Watch what you say. He confessed to me today that he killed Titus and Papa and also made you half blind. Just like I said, <laughs> there's nothing you're saying here that is making me angry. No, because I know you are nothing but a child. You're a child. Anyway, I just want you to know why I'm here. You can see, I came here to bring some things I believe your mother needs. That's why I brought, I brought all these things because I know she needs them. I even heard that sometimes you go out begging for money to take care of your mother. I say it will never happen. Not when Oliver is alive. It's my ministry. If there's anything I do, I touch lives. Yes. So I cannot see it happen. Oloma, uh, that's why uh, now, now I would like you to have the 30,000 naira. Over my dead body. Huh? Over my dead body, will I or anybody from my home accept anything from Evil man like you. Chief, give it to me, Chief. Mama, don't touch that money, oh. That money is evil. Mama, don't touch it. It's a wicked money. Don't touch it, oh. Please. I'm the one that needs the money. Give it to me. Give it to me. I will keep it. Okay, and then I'll take it. Uh, take the money. Hey, uh -huh. thank you. But at the same time, I don't want you to take it uh, so hot with her. She's a little child. Eh? <laughs> what I'm doing is uh, my calling. <laughs> Just take it with her. Don't, don't do anything. Uh, I'll shout on her. It's okay. Mm. Mm. <laughs> chief. 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 Chief Oliver. You're a good man. And your kindness to us shall never go in vain. Hey. As for that land that you've been wanting. Chief. Start planning what you want to do on it. As far as I'm concerned, the land is already yours. Oh, thank you very much. I will surely come back to see you again mm, uh, about the land once i get that land i promise you i'll take you to united states of america usa chief is america for your eye operation yes american kind of normal hey hey chief chief oh. chief you 
to bring tears to my eyes, oh chief. America, chief, may God bless you. Eh? Not those evil people that wanted me to die. Eh? Thank you, chief. Thank you. May God bless you. Amen. Oh, <laughs> Amen. Make sure I get the money. Hmm? And everything will be yours. Everything will be yours. Huh? I'll be on my way now. Thank you. Thank you so much, Chief. Thank you so much. Instead of you to come and help pack the things, you'll be there dying in silence. Dying in silence, a good man that God has sent to help you. Eh? This kind of things, did we even have them when your father was here? Be there now, be there. Keep sighing. <laughs> this small girl, Mabel, that I sent for, she has not even come. Can come and help me and tell me the things that are here. No, oh, what a good man. What a good man. It's not this amount that you told me of. Come on, boy, you carry me around around. This is the land. This is my father's land. Ha. Ah. Thank God, though, we are now on your father's land. I thought we were never going to reach here. Uh, so, where, where did you say the other people stop working and where am I supposed to start working?
don't do. Yeah, cover and back. I don't know when has made you angry. 